Leona coming to you today because I've been shopping because there's been a seasonal change. It is fall, as you know. And I wanted to do some shopping to go with the weather. Or at least that's what I tell myself to justify me purchasing things all the time. One of the first items I purchased for the fall, I actually have not pur purchased recently. I purchased this maybe two months ago when Zara was having their semi-annual or whatever sale. And it's this item right here. It's this purse. I got it because of the color number one. I realized I have been gravitating towards black bags a lot and so now my entire inventory of purses, or it seems my entire inventory, is completely black bags and I wanted to break that up and get some beiges in there some sort of a different color but still staying in the neutral family and I got this one there's only one handle and one strap you know on one side of the bag and it was $20 so I thought it was an absolute steal now on to the recent items like I said before, I was looking to add a little bit of a different color in my whole bag collection. So I was at H&M one day and I came across this purse right here. So I saw this one and it's a nice, you know, small size. It has a lot of room on the inside. It has a zipper in the middle with two sides to put your items in and also a holder for your phone or whatever hand sanitizer you may use you have the smaller straps and you also have the longer straps so you can make it a crossbody bag this was $34.99 next thing I bought was clothes so the first item I have here in clothing is this shirt dress this denim shirt dress from the Gap it has kind of the western style because it has the yoke at the top that has the point and me and shirt dresses are very um, close friends. Me and shirt dresses get along so well. And when I saw this in the store, I had to have it, especially they have pockets. When I saw it in the store, they didn't have my size, so I ordered it online. And I'm happy that I did because, as we all know, with the Gap and with Old Navy, every weekend they have some 30% off deal, 20% off, 40% off deal. So. I got a deal ordering this online. I forget what the final price was, but I think it was between $40 and $50. But I went on to Old Navy's website last weekend and they were having the Columbus Day promotion sale. And the first time ever with the fall, I decided that I wanted to get some sweaters or sweater dresses. And I saw that they had this cable knit sweater dress and it kind of reminds me of a shirt dress with the length and with the shift style. So I purchased it and it fits very comfortably. I'm looking very forward to wearing it. I loved it so much that I got it in the other color that they have, which is this burgundy, oxblood, cranberry color, whatever you want to call it. With the sale, I got these for $26.30. The next item I'm going to show you, I really wasn't even supposed to be getting, but you know, when you walk into a drugstore, a CVS, or a Dwayne Reed, or a Walgreens, or something, you may go by the cosmetics aisle because they make it look so pretty and nice. They had a new display for Milani, so I like to look at the Milani lipsticks. Half the time, every time I go into this particular CVS, they don't have anything new. However, I saw that they had a new nude lipstick, one that I have not heard any woman of color, any beauty gurus on YouTube mention. And I'm always on the market for a nude. I wear nudes in the fall, when all year round. I am constantly on the search for nudes. And I saw that they had this one that's called Bahama Beige, a number 55. And I saw it and had to have it because one of my biggest issues with nude lipsticks is that a lot of them are pink nudes, pinky nudes. My lips are not pink. So every time I see a pinky nude, I get so annoyed. But when I saw this and saw that it was more of a neutral nude or a peach based nude, I don't know if that's the correct 
color. It wasn't pink, I know that. So I fell in love with it and I had to have it. This was like what, three, four dollars. I mean, the Milani lipsticks aren't expensive. The next item I'm gonna show you has nothing to do with fall. I know this. However, so I purchased it now. It's still gonna be included into my fall haul and I feel like it's metallic and metallics go with the fall. So I'm still considering it a fall item. And it is these beautiful shoes right here. Do you see these? Do you just I am in love with these shoes okay so these are part of ASOS's wide fit shoe collection and thank goodness thank goodness for ASOS having this freaking wide shoe collection because of that collection I have been looking forward to wearing heels again and I actually wore these the same day that I got them as you can see and I was able to wear them comfortably without my feet being squeezed terribly and they lasted for at least an hour and a half which is good for me because in the past a shoe can last 20 minutes and I will take them issues off okay the last item I'm going to show you was an absolute must for me because our last couple of winters here in New York have been brutally cold so cold it, it hurts you to the bone and the last two winters I kind of wasn't prepared for it because I've never experienced cold like that in New York before so I have a feeling this winter is going to be the same and I want to be prepared, okay? And one way I'm going to be prepared is by having a freaking thick, huge scarf. And so I came across this scarf, this blanket scarf at Forever 21. And I'm loving the black and white or black and cream color of it. I'm loving the simple design because a lot of times it's I see plaid designs which is also simple but I don't like plaid or snowflakes which is juvenile and I'm just too old to be wearing snowflakes around my neck <laughs> so I saw this and I really loved it it's big enough where I could shoot. look at this look at this I could wear this thing at home like if I want to chill and watch some TV I use this thing as a throw this thing is so big but I'm loving the size of this because, I mean, look at this. Okay, you see what I'm talking about? You see, not any lick of cold air is going to be getting through to my neck or to my chest, okay? I, okay, I'm so happy that I found this. So this was at for 21, like I said, and it was $14. And that's it. That's all the items I've purchased so far for the fall. I really hope I don't really play myself and start buying something every week because, I mean, why am I going to act like I got it like that? I really don't. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.